using plastic bags for shopping in Edmonton could be banned by 2023, which would mean Edmontonians have to pay out of their pocket to buy paper or reusable bags. The city of Edmonton is proposing new rules to ban several single-use items like plastic bags and straws as well as styrofoam cups and containers. We have paper cups, we have other materials we can use, so we don't need to use plastic or styrofoam that is going to ruin things for our kids. I find it's really easy to just bring your own bag with you when you go shopping. I'm totally uh, for it. I'm all about sustainability. The more that we can protect our environment, the better. Edmonton's strategy comes as the federal government is looking to implement a rule pertaining specifically to single-use plastics. But Mayor so he says that municipalities have a significant role to play. We need to lead by example as well. You know, we need to educate Edmontonians what they can do, uh, the simple steps they can take to reduce the use of single-use single use, uh, plastic. I think there's a role. That's why a city will be looking at the bylaw next year. If a bylaw is approved, residents will have to pay a minimum fee of 25 cents for disposable cups, a 15 cent minimum fee on paper bags, and a $1 fee on reusable bags. That they should like more invest into uh, alternatives, you know. I think that would be a better choice instead of like just making us have more fees, right? But others seem to be willing to pay the cost. Sometimes you have to do that just to get to just to remind people that like, oh yeah, next time if I want to avoid that, I'll just bring my own. Absolutely, I would be more than happy to pay an extra few cents or a few dollars for for that cause. Residents will have the opportunity to weigh in on this initiative next spring. We will engage business on this, we will engage Edmontonians, we will engage wider community uh, uh, and learn from other municipalities what has worked effectively and what has been the challenges. When a bylaw is approved, the adoption period will be one year later. Reporting in Edmonton, Heba Kemal Shufi, City News.